Good day, 5130. It's hard to believe we're almost at the end of the first quarter of this year. Do you remember earlier this year when I asked you to imagine how you were going to serve in Rotary, either locally or internationally? Well, I've just spent three months finding out how you're doing just that. I've seen clubs like Wallala, Healdsburg, Santa Rosa, and the Valley of the Moon doing remarkable work supporting education and children at risk. We saw one member of the Rancho Catati Club bring four new members in in one day. Ferndale welcomed Brenna Russ as a new member. We see clubs like Crescent City and Del Norte Sunrise deeply support projects to restore their community, their lighthouse, parks, high school, and community pool. At one meeting, St. Helena recognized over a dozen Paul Harris Fellows. Interact clubs are reforming and forming in places like Mad River and Western Sonoma County. Internationally, Sebastopol helps support education and health in Zimbabwe, Mexico, and Vietnam. Our two Ukiah clubs supported a Peace Pole project. Napa Sunrise and Arcata Sunrise not only bring in new members, but they actively assist them to learn what it takes to become a Rotarian. We're waiting and watching, and really soon we're going to welcome Glen Ellen Kenwood as it reaches its goal of chartering this year. And it's only the first quarter. District 5130 Rotarians are doing such a great job. It's astounding to watch it unfold. Recently, at our annual Institute for Leadership training session, 22 Rotarians from across our district built friendships and increased their leadership skills. I can't wait to see the ways our clubs will achieve their goals this year, particularly in Foundation Giving and Polio Plus. You know, Helen Keller said, I am only one, but still I am one. I cannot do everything, but still I can do something. I will not refuse to do the something I can do. The Rotarians in 5130 are living that every day. I'm Michael Urich and I'm proud to be your governor.